So it's, uh, so we just, I'm vlogging. Say hi, John. Hi, John. <laughs> John's working on his radios, and um, we got up here last night, or yesterday. So today, I've, uh, they went fishing. He and um, his, uh, the guys went fishing, and the women sat around and complained about the guys. No, not really, sort of. No, we didn't really. But, um, yeah, last night was the big, I, I, have, I got a phone call at 3 a.m. this morning from my daughter because she works at a facility that was really affected um, by the um, crowd strike uh, update. So, we got a phone call at 3 a.m. and it sort of freaked us out because we didn't have all the details and I couldn't hardly get on the internet. So, uh, we did find out this morning that it was, you know, it got the details of it. Um, and so, but it is affecting a lot of people today, but we're up here off the grid, so uh, it's not, not too bad here where we are, but we're making brunch. The guys got back from fishing, and we're making brunch. I got hash browns cook cooking here. I put in some peppers and onions. We have a outdoor kind of burner. We have a burner out there outdoors. We're doing the bacon and eggs. And Roscoe is not feeling great. I think all the traveling has just gotten to him today. He's worn out. So he's, and plus we were up uh, most of the night just trying to talk to my daughter and make sure everything was okay. So, yeah, anyway, it's a... Uh, a new day and it's beautiful up here. Okay, we got hash browns and what's in here? Bacon? Bacon. And some green chili. Eggs and green chili. Tortillas. Open that bacon. This is called roughing it. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, we're here at Clear Creek reservoir. I'm going to just kind of pan. That's our, our setup there. We have about six campers all circled around. And there's a lot of big groups that kind of come here and stick together. There's a big group out there that's from Texas. And there's John with Roscoe in the backpack because we wanted some exercise and He's a pretty good walker, but when we're trying to actually get a good hike in with exercise, we put him in the backpack. So we're just taking a little hike. And now we're over here by the river. It's like a three minute walk. It's very short from our camper to this point. There's the, is that the Arkansas, John? Clear Creek Bridge, no. This oh, this is, is a creek. creek. Oh, this is Clear Creek, yeah. Feeds into the Clear Creek Reservoir. There's some rafters there. Inner tubes, mm -hmm. not, not rafters, inner tubers. Yeah, that's fine. Camping in campgrounds only. So we're, there's a couple of hiking trails and we're just taking one of these hiking trails. We won't go too far because uh, we have to get back to the camper by noon and get on the amateur radio bands for Parks on the Air. Look how pretty. We've got bushes of these purple flowers. I'm going to check my flower guide when I get back to the camper because we have very spotty internet. 
So I have I've been filming, but I haven't really been able to to upload them. So I'll be uploading videos. I think I just uploaded one that was a little bit past our camping because this one will follow follow our travel day and well anyway, I'm rambling. But I'll check those flowers when I get back to the camper because I have some flower guides. get a close-up of these. I, I think this is what the little chipmunk was eating. I would gotten a clip the other day of a chipmunk and I think I already posted that video in the last vlog but I think they were he was eating that yellow flower because they're right behind our camper. This is quite an uphill walk. So that's where we came from, and the trail's down there, and it snakes around. So you can see we've already hiked up a pretty good hill. And now it looks like it's going to flatten out a bit, thank goodness. But we're at about 9,000 feet here above sea level, so it's about twice where we live. And um, you can tell, you know, we get a little more winded, and and all, but not, it's not bad. It's got to stay hydrated, hydrated, hydrated. Oh, I was wrong. We're going up. We went down. Now we're going to curve around here and we're going to go back up. We're going to continue to climb. I think we're going to turn around soon. See, we've had quite the climb already. So there is private property on the other side of those yellow uh, posts. So we can't go that way. I think we're ready to head back. I'm ready. Although we could continue down this way. But then it, I think it does go around here and then it goes there. Oh, it dead ends right there. That's as far as you can go. Yeah, because I think that goes into private property. It might, it might go around that corner though. But we're not going to find out today. What did you want me to show? Oh yeah, there's our campers. Mm -hmm. So down there's the campground. So we did a nice little climb. Got some exercise. My hammies are feeling it. Let's head back. Roscoe, you ready? We're going to go back and get on the radios for a little while. That's what John really is looking forward to. He loves getting on the amateur radio. Oh, I felt felt a drop, felt a raindrop. Oh, yeah. We let Ross go out for the. It's downhill from here, so we let him out. He wanted out. It's like I'm ready, ready to walk around a bit. And it's still sprinkling, just just sprinkling every now and then, but not bad. So. We'll see if we get any rain. Oh, you can see the reservoir down there. Off in the off in the distance there. Let me zoom in a bit. Right right down there. Back at the bridge. No rain. Missed out on that. I think it passed us up. You can see the blue skies up there. Right. Now we're back at our group. Is the frequency in use? Is the frequency in use? This is November Zero Hotel Alpha X ray. You've got feedback coming through your speakers. Did you hear that? Big time. 
CQ Parks on the Air, CQ Parks on the Air. This is November Zero Hotel Alpha X-Ray, along with the second up, calling CQ Parks, CQ Parks on the Air. We're at US 9630-9630. This is N0HAX, calling CQ Poda and standing by. Okay, I got India Tango Charlie. Uh, come again, please. Okay, Kilo Echo Zero India Tango Charlie. This is November Zero Hotel Alpha X Ray. I'm Park US 9630. You're about a 5757 five, seven here in the park, and then I've got a second up when you're ready. Okay, here you go. Is that 59? Yeah, 57. Five, this is November Zero Hotel uh, Romeo Alpha. November Zero Hotel Romeo Alpha here at Park 9630. You're a 57 here. And I've got your Kilo Echo Zero Tango or India Tango Charlie. Copy. Uh, Ask him what his park is. And uh, and what is your park? What is your park number? Uh, US 2922. 2922. What is it? 2922. QSO. Copy your 2922. US 2922. Copy. Thanks for stopping. Thank you for, for the contact and uh, 73s. QRZ. All right, we've got pork chops and steaks cooking on the grill. We've got biscuits cooking in the oven. And I'm doing instant potatoes, three packs of these Idahoan uh, butter, buttery home style and you just mix them with water and they're actually not bad. So yeah, we're here standing in the kitchen in the camper, but uh, I thought I'd show you the view. We're getting ready to eat dinner. We had pancakes this morning. We sure have been eating well. Uh, we don't even eat lunch. I did bring stuff for sandwiches. Take a peek into the fridge. Um, I did my grocery shopping haul the other day for camping and you can see everything in here. I've got cake mix and I've got um, a couple extra things. Let's see. I've got my creamers, I got yogurt, orange juice, some uh, spicy mini guacamoles. There's some chocolate donuts and lettuce and uh, turkey. And we love this. This is my favorite kind of turkey. Um, some tortillas, cheese, butter. I did get some of these uh, cherry plums, and they're pretty good, but they're not super ripe. So I don't know if I should have them in the fridge, but it's so hot. So there's some condiments. And I had the, um, let's see, if I could find it up here. Oh, maybe it's in here. That's some of the stuff I have up there. Chips and chocolate chip cookies. That's kind of my junk drawer, my drunk junk cabinet. Our Pete's coffee for coffee in the morning. And then I have some ravioli, although we won't use it. But in a pinch, it's something to have if you're hungry. And you just don't get, I don't know, you never know when you're camping if something goes wrong with the camper. <laughs> so you just never know. Or you just don't feel like cooking. Um... I got, oh, here's what I got the, the frosting for, is this Jiffy uh, Golden Yellow Cake Mix. And I just keep this on hand, and that way if we kind of want a cake or something, um, I can make one and <laughs> frost it. So, anyway, um, takes up less room than trying to bring, like, a little cake or something. And we don't always want, like, that kind of dessert. And I just bring a little bottle of tea and some salad dressing and some... Graham's crackers because you never know when you want s'mores and I do have marshmallows in there and I have some Hershey bars here too so um, so we're going to be eating dinner here shortly and 
Uh, it's about six o'clock, so we've been here a couple. Well, this is we came here. We've been here two days. Well, we arrived and then, oh goodness, I'm lo I totally looked uh, lose track. We came. We we arrived on a Thursday, and this is Saturday. And we're either going home tomorrow or Monday. We haven't decided yet because I think everyone else is leaving tomorrow. And we were thinking we might stay one more day, but we just haven't decided. It's been pretty windy um, and a bit and a little bit of rain, but not bad. So we're kind of thinking we might head back tomorrow, but we'll see. Leaving our options opened.